for Texas. Uh, Tyrese Hunter up top. A three-pointer that won't at the buzzer the other night. In the paint, Kalkbrenner. Carr driving into the lane. Nice pass underneath. And this. Here's Carr around the screen. Puts it off the window. No. Was a reserve last year. Did not start, but he's in the starting five this year. After a great run at Texas Tech, got to the national title game a couple years ago. Carr in. Extra pass. Shireman driving baseline. Tried to spread Underwood. You love those stories of guys that work for decades as assistants or head coach. On the drive, Nemhard off the window, gets it on the offensive boards. Shireman gets some airspace. Can't get other. It's a, a poised family, the DNA. Offensive rebound in the dribble. Mitchell high post, shot won't fall. Here's Hunter spotting up. No good. And just the end of the year with a broken wrist. Alexander's from Alexander, good with the ball. Alexander got it to top runner underneath and missile. Here's Timmy Allen with their leading score last year's roll. I thought he was really antsy in Maui, forcing a lot, turning it over. The sacrifice for the good of the team. Toluna pulls up and the dribble. Well done. Kaluma's going to try a three that here tonight that he's got more than just athleticism. Them hard with the lot. But was very common poise there with that attempt. They leave Mitchell wide open off runner. He's got six. The lead crate, which has a one point lead. That's Kaluma with the hesitation. Fires to the corner. Shireman. Dylan DeSue, who grew up 20 miles north of Austin, started at Vandy, came, in, came off a serious knee injury a year ago, but he's. Late tournaments would have been eight, but then COVID obviously cost everybody the NCAA tournament. 24 and 7 record that year. They would have been a high seed in 2020 when COVID hit. And we asked him this pregame. A little bit younger. Yes, we have NCAA tournament experience, but we're playing a lot of young guys. We start three sophomores. That's exact for He was there for four years. He's got the ball in the low block. Goes up and can't finish. The team in block shots. But as you mentioned, coming off the bench now with the Rod working on car. Those two go way back. They grew up together. Nemhard takes the three over. Possession there for Creighton. Here's Timmy Allen in transition. Good screen set. And then two Texas guys went right by the ball. And then actually that foul. High for Creighton. Here's Alexander. Pull up jumper. Blocked. But yeah, and actually, by rule, hand is part of the ball. But James Breeding had a good look. Jabari Rice just asked James Breeding. Alex are off to a slow start. Just one for five shooting. He averages 15 points per game. Obviously, that would change with a win tonight. Here's Carr pulling up, misfiring. Bishop driving. Fakes right, go. Mitchell. Both these teams are deep. Backdoor cut. Out. On the wing, Marcus Carr spotting up. Spins. TCU transfer. Here he is. And that both coaches want to shoot the ball, are shooting it. And that's why you got the low percentages. We have been excellent. That's part of the issue. Cunningham has some freedom there, but can't. Guys who are low percentage shooters to shoot it, and they're obliging. Hunter from two at Iowa State, and then transferred here to Austin. The new world we live in, college basketball. Oh, there you go. Hunter with the steal. Here comes the challenge. Hunter hangs. Shots from the floor. Ken Farabella, a little hesitant, gets into the lane. Tough shot, gets to the elbow. Extra pass by Nemhard, wide open, but unable to connect with Kalu. Hunter uses the screen. The Sioux, minutes without a point for Creighton, 0 for its last eight, and looked like a flop, perhaps for flop. Absolutely, there's just too much gray area for legitimate charge opportunities. A wide open underneath, Kalkbrenner didn't go up for the shot. Kalu was looking at him like, what are you doing? You had nobody else. It could have been the player that committed or anybody else on that team, and it would have been a technical foul. Dribbles out, the shot clock at five. Oh, good shot fake. Timers now at three, Rice lets it go. It's because both coaches have the right guys shooting it. Our pass that time by for McDermott here, year two for Beard. Was it a student assistant for Tom? Ben 
hard stop to the elbow and reaching in is Shireman on him, perhaps. Allen driving, fade away, and the black hole got eight points and four of four shooting. Paluma driving, wild oh. shot. Now Alexander, the hunter right there in his grill. Call Brenner, there was some contact with three. Texas as a team is 0 for 5 from three. Good pass underneath. Kaluma puts body control on that last possession there. Hunter is going to let it fly. In and out. Up. And Zaga, Texas not the same level of competition. Here's Carr with the floater. Big guys are in vogue. Demhard with a kick out. Shireman for three. Texas 0 for its last four. Two and a half minutes without a point. And Creighton leads by one from three. One combined made three between these three. It's two. Carr kept the dribble. Nobody closes out on him, so he takes the jump. Good pass out of the double team by Kalkbrenner. Now a skip and a three that won't. A big guy like Kalkbrenner. Front by one. Nearing two minutes to go in the opening half. Demhard was fouled. It looked like a jumper. Hunter coming off the screen. Drives the lane. Goes to the left. And out of bounds that time by Carr. We have not had uh, very many fouls called to number one in the country. They were ranked as high as number five last year. Oh. Screen set by Mitchell. Hunter and Cochran with a great. Back to the basket. Now up and under. Missed the shot. Marcus Carr. Carr just 65% at the line on the season. But drink. They have been a little subdued. Again, perhaps with the early start, Nemhard got. Baseline cut off by Nemhard as Hunter was trying to drive. Now a shoot for three. Braden with him, two, 40 seconds to go. Carr with a pull up jumper. Oh. Now on the switch, Mitchell's on him. Three seconds to go. Nemhard long two. Oh. Did to Shireman, and he's normally an excellent three point shooter. He was 0 for 6. Nemhard missed. Golf runner. Working on Dessou and power to the seventh foot. What's the lob here? It's dead to kick out to Carr on the spot of three. <laughs> on the baseline, around it out for Mitchell. Ranked team right now between Texas and Kansas. Jayhawks are number nine as Colt Brenner is. Blue Jay fans, they were so young, Dave. And as Greg McDermott told us. Colt Brenner missed his first free throw, 76% on the season at the strike. Preseason first team all Big E. And the driver. On the cut. Bishop. I'll tell you, this has been a great matchup. Hunter has been all over. Nice cut. Columbo. Of the pressure of the freshman who was thinking steal again. And they baited him. On display of Arthur Kaluma, who originally signed with UNLV, coming out of lead. Three minutes gone by in the second half. Great has never beaten a team ranked in the top. Out to Alexander. Another miss fire. Allen on the open floor. Kaluma with the lob and the other end. Allen drives and seven from the floor. 15 points. Bishop in the paint. Over call Frenner. No. But Carr has it for the long haul. Push it here. Carr does. Driving the teeth of the lane. Missed the lane. Ball down three. Largest lead for either team was Texas a moment ago with eight. By call Frenner. Mitchell gets fouled and gets booty center. Just opened this season. Every game they've been over 10,000. Tries to go inside. Now kicks it to Kaluma. Three pointer won't go. King, a freshman from the Bahamas. Again, they push tempo. Shireman misses again. Farabello off the bench. They need some shooting. Hunter driving. Missed the shot last year. At, North, at South Dakota State. No. Carr buries that. But he kept shooting. Alexander with a pull up. No. Shire. Good defense by Texas. Here's Carr again pushing tempo. Nice pass. On the move. Sweet. Bishop. Goes to the right hand and puts win against the top. 10 team here at home. They play Illinois next week. Like a national title contender again tonight. Here's Carr off the front rim. Here's Morris. No good. And with the block out, they eventually get it ahead though to Alexander. Driving 15. Couldn't get the shot off, so Pump Brenner now with a little block. 
They double him again. Matchup Hunter and Nemhard. He has shut Ryan Nemhard down until today. Number four prospect by ESPN coming out of high school last year. And our friend Paul. Back to a single digit deficit now for the Blue Jays on the road. Nice pass by Rice to Mitchell. Opportunity for Creighton. Nemhard goes to the defender. Missed the lamp. Soaring in there. Because of how hard I work out, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow I think it's from three. Only 35% overall. Nemhard maybe starting to get more aggressive. But in school history, fifth time they've been to number seven, never higher. Mitchell. Create some uh, driving opportunities. There you go. Nemhard missed that top. Drop, drop. And Carr took it as far as he could, and he shot a 10-footer. Wow. Carr gets into the paint, puts up the shot. And point lead for Texas. Carr again driving. Mitchell lays it. Extra pass. They need it. They don't get it. Farabello missing. There. Nemhard cannot get past the bigger Bishop. Now he does it. He's glad to see him back. Nemhard knocks it down. Here's Allen. Nice move. And then leaning in is fouled. But three assists tonight for Allen. And gets the bounce on the foul shot. Scouraging and unfortunate Timmy's mom, Elise. Passed away back in 2016. A three from Shireman. Oh. Shot clock at three. Kaluma puts it up. Off the back rim, no. Rebound by... An even more dangerous number two team in the country. Watch out. Another dunk for Kultbrenner. Back out. Allen, catch and shoot. Got it. And attacking. Kicks it out. Kaluma for three. He has the 33. I went to Syracuse. I'm not sure what the math is on that. They backed off the What a pass. Kalkbrenner missed the shot. His first miss. This kid is working on uh, all sorts of skills, and the kid is a very good player. 78% of the season six in the country. But just one for three at the line. He's, he checks back in. Bishop hesitated. Now lets it fly, and it's not close. Every time he catches it deep. Nemhart driving. Left-hander. What a great play. play that. Allen dribbling through the paint. Tries to power it up and in. No. A knuckleball pitcher. That's what he is. Nemhart's three. No good. They're one for 20. Shot clock inside 10. From the foul line. It's good. As an Aggie. He's from Houston originally. Finally a three. Car fouled by Alexander. That's old. Every jab from Creighton and responded beautifully at the Irwin Center. Shot clock at two. Shireman has to put it up. And he scores oh. for Texas. Here's a three-point try from Rice. No good. And finally on the floor. Kaluma playing with just one shoe. Another miss from Deep Allen trying to keep it alive. Seven. Here comes the double. Kalkbrenner trying to fire underneath. Good hands by Rice. With three, Alexander pull up jumper. No good. Back side of ten. Back out to Carr. Tires at five. Carr on the pull up. That's good. Them hard looking to drive. Goes up. Way off the mark. Long rebound. Greg McDermott gave the signal. We have to. Jim made the play of the night on defense. Alexander hoists a three. Mistress pass. They get it to Rice. Great trying to foul. And Kaluma commits it. So the next ball. They missed it. Yep. Rebound, Kalkbrenner. They got it. And Texas will switch out on the three. Shireman. And he drills oh it. And Hunter wide open. And the dunk. Got to get it back out. Here's Shireman. And Shireman nails it. And oh, it's dangerous. Oh, man. Close to five seconds. He got it inbounds to cause a rebound. And he knocks it down. Big four point. And if you're Creighton, you got to get this ball up to court quickly to make it a two-possession game. No timeouts for the Blue Jays. Carr got a The lead is five. And watch Nemar. He's going to save it. There you go. Eight seconds to go. Nemar driving to get the two. There was some contact. Help the basket. Consider they did not shoot well tonight. Gets it both. Five-point lead. Now Texas. Hi, ESPN crew. I'm Dave Pash. So long from Austin.